play around with big A. Any issues with that? For example, let's say you have zero. Zero. It's zero. What's big A of, what do they ask here for? Two. There's no formulas given here, although if you want to, you could come up with formulas. You can do this whole problem without formulas, though. We will do it without formulas, and then we're going to do a problem with formulas here that always drives people crazy on the homework on 5.3. Nathan. Why? Why? Uh, a radius. Yeah. So do we know what that area of a quarter circle radius 2 is? Yeah. Yep. It's 1 fourth, quarter chicken white again, times pi times 2 squared, which is nice 4, and the 4s cancel out. So pi was the incorrect answer. It was Michael? Yeah. No. Alex? Negative pi. It's actually negative pi because it's underneath the axis. Big A of, I know, technicality. All right. There's, I think, I think on the grading guide where you, where you can get one point for pi on that. Very generous people. Big A of four. Can you find uh, the area of the, or can you find the area of both? So you have the yeah, triangle. This, this is sweeping out all the way to four. four. So you get what you had before. Negative pi plus two. You got I don't know where you're getting two from. Uh, well, at four, you just have like the straight line so you can make it a triangle yep. and then and that's yeah. a nice right triangle to boot yeah and it's uh two or one leg is two and the other one's in the height is two so you have one half two times two yep <coughs> negative pi plus two negative two plus minus pi or two minus pi i should say and finally big a of six now which is the square of two you're gonna have this two minus pi from before plus four four why because it's a square with length of side two so this is <coughs> six minus pi part b sketch a graph of this not sketch a graph of f, but sketch a graph of a. <coughs> a couple different ways you could do this. You could argue, think about this as your area moving here. Okay, you could argue this two ways, but we'll all we'll do kind of a waving the hands one here, but we'll do a systematic way as well. What's happening to the area as I move out this way? My area is what at the beginning, by the way? A of zero was, zero. Riley, zero. zero. What happens to the area from this point? Does it increase or decrease? Decrease. decrease. Got two different answers here. I got an increased answer, I got a decreased answer. I mean, it's, it's going negative pi, so yeah. it's decreasing. Got more and more negative area here going on here. So it's gonna kind of decrease here, not quite sure how and that, but it's certainly not decreasing at a constant rate because your circle is not constant right there. So we're gonna start decreasing here, and when is it gonna hit its min? Two. So why? Because that's when it hit, uh, changes from decreasing to increasing. Yeah, all of a sudden you're starting to add in positive area. Notice what you're graphing here when you're graphing A of X is you're graphing the area. What's happening to the area as it changes there? And so what's going to happen there? Is it going to ever decrease again for the rest of the problem? No. 
So it's going to increase here, except it's going to increase at varying rates here, obviously, right? Like this, because of the triangle that. They set you straight? 